At 625, we continue to see varying types of precipitation. Now, why are we seeing sleet and freezing rain here in Austin despite freezing cold temperatures at the surface with temperatures into the 20s and 30s? Well, there's a layer of warm, relatively warm, that is, temperatures above freezing, a few thousand feet up in the sky. So you need that entire layer of the atmosphere to be below freezing to experience that snow. That's what we're seeing out towards uh, portions of the hill country, further out towards the north and west from Abilene down through Waco. But again, what we saw earlier with all rain, it was well above freezing here at all layers of the atmosphere. Freezing rain, well, just a very shallow layer of below freezing temperatures out at the surface. That's actually liquid rain that doesn't have time, enough time to refreeze. So it freezes on contact with the cold ground. And that's why you see that ice and then those ice pellets or sleet. That just means that there is a thicker layer of warmer temperatures in the middle of the atmosphere. So it starts up as snow high up in the sky, melts a little bit, and then refreezes into sleet.